Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm going to be showing you how to get from Tradassil all the way to Elwyn Forest in World of Warcraft on Hardcore mode. So that's a mode that means you cannot die. So naturally, this route is a little bit different. To get from Tradassil to Elwyn Forest, players normally have to navigate through the wetlands. I am going to show you a better way, a way that you don't actually have to risk your life. You just have to swim, swim and survive. Over here, you can see that you can either go left or right. Right will take you to the boat, left will take you to the griffin. Both of these routes are perfectly fine and will take you to the right place. So just pick whichever one you prefer. Personally, I go with the griffin because I can get it when I want it. So now that you've arrived at the wetlands, go pick up the flight path. Obviously you will want to have this flight path for when you start questing in this area and you don't want to walk all the way over here again. So as you can see I'm at the pier and I'm walking down the pier because I want to actually jump into the water a little bit further out from the shoreline. As you can see there are huts on the shoreline and those huts contain melocks. These Melocs are around level 20 and they will attack you if they see you because you're level one. Uh, some of them that are in the water actually have pretty decent aggro range and they will throw things at you. So you will be one shot if they see you. So be sure to stay far to the right and out of their way.
So as you're approaching Westfall shoreline, you really want to go towards this boat. This boat does not have any aggro mobs around it, so it is a safe swim. Now that we are on the shoreline, you want to follow what I do exactly. You want to walk right up the cliff and then hug the cliff all the way around. Sometimes there will be gnolls and other kind of mobs that are spawning around there. Typically, like you can see in this run, they will be gone. Players would have killed them. All you need to do is just navigate around the different aggro mobs. So the ones that you really got to look out for are the gnolls and the wolves. As long as you can avoid them and make your way to the river along Jamis instead, you will be fine. And bam, you're done. You're in L1 Forest. Congratulations. I hope you found this guide a little bit helpful and it made your journey from Tredassil to L1 Forest a little bit more exciting and safe. Remember, in hardcore mode, if you die, that means it's the end of your character. You've got to delete it. So stay safe and keep swimming. Mm -hmm.